Hey everybody, this is Brian. This is uh, Visual Basic tutorial number 16, if you've been watching. Uh, today we're going to talk about the queue. Uh, queue is another collection class. So let's say dim line as queue. And let's actually do the generic version, queue of t. So let's say of string. And then once again, new queue of string. Now, what are we doing here? Well, the Q class is a first in, first out. Think of it as a line, like a line at a bank. The first person in the line is the first person out. So let's say line, and we have to do things a little differently here. We have to enqueue them or add them. So we will add, uh, say Bob. Let's stick with Bob, Mary, and Chad. Now, this is the line, and this is the order they're in, Bob, Mary, and Chad. When you want to get people from this line, you'd say console dot right line line dot tq. And what that will do is that we'll get the person who's next in line, in this case Bob, and also remove him from that list so he's no longer in line. Let's just run this and see what happens. Now you see it returns Bob. Bob is no longer in that list. And to prove that, let's actually say uh, we're going to write the number of items in here. So console dot write line and we're going to say line dot count. So we're going to print the count, we're going to DQ Bob, and then print the count again. And let's actually just throw count equals, that way we can see what's going on here. Run it again. You see that there are three people in line, we grab Bob, and then there's only two people in line. So that's how a queue works. You can always reference the count to determine how many people you have left in there. So that's a queue. That's a first in, first out. Uh, hope you found this video educational and entertaining, and thank you for watching.